Matthew here with Disaster Area, showing the procedure to update your Strymon pedals using a Gen 2 DMC pedal. We've got one of the new DMC2 uh, Plus pedals, so it's basically a DMC2 with a, an LED display added um, and USB MIDI built in. We've connected from the MIDI out to the MIDI in of the Mobius, and you can use this for bank up, bank down, program up, program down. Um, on the timeline, there's actually a looper mode that you can access. It doesn't do anything on the Mobius, of course, but it is there for you to use on the timeline. Um, we're connected to a Mac using SysX Librarian, and uh, if you look at the destination, which is the place where we want to send our SysX data, uh, it says Disaster MIDI. So if you plug your Disaster Area Controller into uh, your Mac or your Windows PC, you'll see a Disaster MIDI device here. Okay, so the cabling is really standard. It's a MIDI cable from MIDI out to MIDI in, exactly the same as you'd use on your pedal board. Um, and all we need to do is hit play on SysX Librarian. So before we play, let's just go into the test mode to verify the firmware revision we're currently running. So hold the tap button at power up and go until it says revision and then tap the encoder. You see we're Mobius 1.06. So we'll power down and power back up to get into a mode where we can actually update. Uh, I'm going to hit the play button on SysX Librarian to play back the selected file. And as soon as I do that, it's going to start sending SysX data. The Mobius display will blank, and then it'll show loading, or load NG. Uh, the digits will flash to let us know that we're receiving data. At the end of the process, the Mobius will reboot, and uh, we'll see that it's in a new revision. So we'll fast forward this a little bit. Alright, and we're getting close to the end here, so as soon as this is done, the Mobius will reboot, and it will say Mobius. And if we power it off and power it back on in test mode, again holding tap while we power up, and we roll the encoder until it says revision, tap, now we're on 1.08, so we've successfully updated the Mobius firmware. This works on the Timeline and the Big Sky as well. So if you're running an older version of the Timeline firmware and you just bought a shiny new DMC 3XL in vintage orange perhaps, uh, or you're using any of the Gen 2 pedals, basically anything with the screen will allow you to update the firmware using the pedal as a USB device. Um, the one thing to keep in mind is that if you're updating the pedal using this as a USB device, it's a good idea to uh, disable the expression pedal input for example, setting it to tap in the setup menu, and it's also a good idea to not touch this at all during the update process. Um, it's generally pretty bulletproof, but if you send a command in the middle, uh, it can interrupt the flow of SysX from the computer back to the Strymon pedal. So it's a good idea to just leave it alone. Um, any questions, post them in the comments below. Um, we've got the DMC2+, Plus, DMC3 XL Gen 2, DMC4 Gen 2, all the DMC Gen 2 range are capable of this. Uh, so check them out on our website, disasterareadesigns.com. Thanks for watching.